Hello, and do you like the Call of Duty storyline? You know, if you are a teenage boy and you like shooting game, playing the old Call of Duty, you know, from Call of Duty 2 to all the way to Modern Warfare 3, like it is a joy ride to go through as a teenage boy. And especially for the 1 to 3, it is just an extremely fun experience to go through the old one. But now, the new one is, in my opinion, they're not as good as it old version. Especially on the Modern Warfare 3, I have saw a lot of people complaining about the game and how terrible it is in a lot of things. So of course I will be talking about some spoilers, so if you don't want to, then go play the game or watch other people's YouTube video. But yeah, so the whole no rusher scene, I think, yeah, it is not a really fun scene to go through. Like not fun in playing because there's not really much stuff to go through. You just, you know, escort and even the terrorist thing, it's just not really a fun experience to go through. And I understand why because, you know, it is the whole controversial behind no rusher. It's something that people talk about and in some way I understand why but Call of Duty have built a franchise on the campaign I think it's okay to take risks on that but you know they don't want to so this is the consequence that they have to face the other thing is that so that scene is terribly executed there's no climax there no stake being raised in that situation nothing and so it's just a really I would say terribly done scene in general and I believe that they only do it because you know they want to follow the Modern Warfare 3 format right where soap die but compared to that to the dying scene on the old version the newer version is only there because it needs to be there it, there's no betrayal there's no story behind it they're just terrible terrible stuff I do not enjoy a single second of that moment at all. It's just not really fun and sad or anything. Like I don't feel anything when that scene happened compared to the old one. It's just a completely disappointing scene. And you know what worst of all is that the scene is so anticlimactic. Like after soap dying scene, like the the player, the YouTuber that I watched in a video. They don't know what to do, like they just stand there jumping up and down because they don't know what to do. And so it just terribly execute overall and I completely understand why people are mad at the game. The final thing is that the ending of the game, I think they're gonna milk it for that is why they keep Makarov, the villain of the game, alive. Like that's it. They kill Shepard in the most boring way possible. Like bro the entire game. It's just an insult to the older version. Every part of the old version scream action and excitement, betrayal, emotional damage, and everything a soldier could have. But in this newer version, I don't know, they, they just think it like a movie or something. Basically a movie, in my opinion. A boring uh, action movie. But yeah, that's my thought on the whole franchise. Personally, I don't have any problem with Modern Warfare 1 and 2 because you know they are an okay game. They're not as good as the old version and the story-wise it's just lackluster in my opinion. Other than that, it's okay to go to but Modern Warfare 3 take the cake on being the worst game in the whole franchise right now. But yeah, that's my opinion. What about you? Did you play the game? And what do you think about the newer version of the game? Do you like it or do you think the same as I did? Let me know in the comment down below. Thank you for watching. See you next one. Goodbye.